Greetings, my confectionery compadres, and welcome to Randy Makes Candy, where I help you make tasty treats that people love to eat. February 5th is World Nutella Day, so I found a recipe that combines Nutella, pretzels, and chocolate in a way I think you're really going to like. I found it on the Life, Love, and Sugar website, and I'll leave a link in the description so you can go check it out. As always, I'd love to hear about your results if you decide to make your own Nutella pretzel bites, as well as suggestions for other recipes you'd like to see in future videos. For this recipe, I used two tablespoons of room temperature unsalted butter, one cup of Nutella, three quarters of a cup of powdered sugar, some mini pretzel squares, one and a half cups of white chocolate, and some chocolate sprinkles. I also used a mixer, a bowl, a spatula, and a lined cutting board. Okay, let's make some candy. Combine the butter and Nutella in a mixing bowl. Cream it until it's well combined. Stir in the powdered sugar and mix until it forms a dough. Add additional powdered sugar if needed. Roll some of the dough into a ball and place it on the lined cutting board. If it's too sticky to work with, add more powdered sugar. Continue with the rest of the dough. I'm going to take a break here for a word from our sponsor, me. <laughs> yeah, I'm just a little niche YouTube channel that hopes to someday earn enough money to pay for my supplies. If you want to help me reach that goal, the best things you can do are to keep watching and share these videos with your friends. But there is something else you can do if you're of a mind. Right down there is a little thanks button. If you click on that, you'll be able to donate to the channel. It starts out at $2 and goes up to a ridiculously high amount. I know times are tough right now, and if you can't donate, you're still a compadre, and I still love you madly. But if you can help, I'll be very grateful. Okay, back to the recipe. Sandwich a dough ball between two pretzel squares and return it to the lined cutting board. Repeat this with the rest of the dough balls. Melt or temper the chocolate. Dip a pretzel bite halfway into the chocolate and return it to the lined cutting board. Add some sprinkles. Repeat with the remaining bites and leave them on the counter to set. And that's it! Okay, let's have a taste. Slantje va! Okay, very crunchy, as I'm sure you heard, and the Nutella dough has a silky smooth texture to it. The Nutella flavor really comes through with a nutty chocolate richness that's almost decadent. The salt on the pretzels adds a nice layer of flavor as well. And if you wanted to make these for a holiday, like Valentine's Day or Easter, you could just use appropriately colored sprinkles and they'll fit right in. If you're looking for a way to celebrate World Nutella Day or just make a tasty treat, you really ought to try these. I found it on the Life, Love, and Sugar website. If it's too sticky to work with, add more power. Add more power.
golly. Add more powered, <laughs> powered sugar. Yeah, plug it in, baby.